Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for January the 24th of 2021. Well, it is titled Massive Nearby Spiral Galaxy NGC 2841. So what do we see here? Well, this is a very massive spiral galaxy, something even larger than our own Milky Way. And when we look at this, we see the spiral arms spreading around uh, the galaxy and very uh, tightly wound spiral arms, it appears as they're very closely packed together. So a little bit different than some other galaxies, but we do see the other uh, components that we are used to seeing with spiral galaxies such as the disk the spiral arms that we've mentioned and the signs of recent star formation within those spiral arms and we see many pink hydrogen regions shining with the glowing light of hydrogen gas when it is excited and some of the blue star clusters scattered around as well those hot blue stars which don't live for a very long time and therefore tell us they must have formed recently. For example, if a star only lives for about 10 million years and we see it around today, it had to have formed in the last 10 million years because otherwise it would no longer be present. So the fact that we can see stars that live such a short time means that galaxies like this and like our own still are still forming stars today. Now when we look at spiral galaxies or any other types of galaxies, we're looking out into space and we're looking back into time. In astronomy, we never see anything as it is exactly right now. As an example, this galaxy is 46 million light years away. Now that's a distance that we can barely begin to comprehend. But what it means is that the light from this galaxy takes 46 million years to reach the Earth. So the light that we're seeing from it right now is not how this galaxy looks today, but how this galaxy looked 46 million years ago. Now what might have changed in that time? Well, if you remember, I told you that some of these stars only live for 10 million years or so. That means the stars that we're seeing there are no longer in existence. They are gone and have evolved through their lives and many of them may have exploded as supernovae. We don't know about it yet because the light has not yet had time to reach us. So if this cluster is 46 million light years away and a star exploded 40 million light 40 million years ago, we would still have to wait another 6 million years for that light to traverse the great distance between us and the galaxy in order for us to be able to see it. So when we look at galaxies, the details we see are what was present long ago. However, as we look at them on overall structure, galaxies will not normally change very significantly. So we can say with pretty good confidence that this galaxy looks pretty much like this today. The details will have changed. Many stars have gone through their lives and other stars have formed. But the overall structure probably looks pretty much the same as it does in this image. However, in order to verify that we would have to wait the 46 million years for the light that is just leaving this galaxy now to reach us. So that was our picture of the day for January the 24th of 2021. It was titled Massive Nearby Spiral Galaxy NGC 2841. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be volcanic cross. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone. And I will see you in class.